from Dominic Toretto to Orange Julius, you could be next, if your pockets are deep enough. As Meekum Auctions gears up for their 36th original Spring Classic event in Indianapolis, it's announced a well-known, highly recognizable collectible from the famous Fast and Furious movie series based on Mazda's legendary FD Generation RX-7, a car that, like many 1990s produced sports cars, continues to gain value among collectors and avid enthusiasts alike. This 1993 model is unique not only because of its series of modifications and eye-searing paint but also because it served as one of five RX-7s used by Vin Diesel's Dominic Toretto character in the original The Fast and the Furious. It was then rebuilt with a whole new look and used by Amalrin Alasco's Orange Julius Persona in the second installment of the multi-billion dollar big screen franchise. The FD kept its house of color orange pearl paint work with vibrant yellow graphics modern image laid over a versus body kit and J-Spec hood. Topped off with a set of 18-inch row underscore jaw wheels, the FD maintains its early 2000s style. A closer look reveals the car's solid exterior condition aside from some rock chips, paint blemishes, and slightly severed fiberglass on the front bumper, just in front of the passenger side wheel and the side skirt. Twenty years after its makeover, it's certainly been cared for in all of that time. Sparco sprint seats and harnesses replace the factory pieces and there are but two gauges atop the dash. The gauge clusters around center stack, and shifter surround were painted silver and, based on the photos, the rear interior panels appear to be spray-painted black, but both are easily replaceable. There are multiple LED light ones mounted throughout the cabin and in the rear cargo area is a fuel cell that was active for the movie scenes, but now just a display piece and the factory tank is back on duty. Under the hood you'll find the original, untouched 13B and the only changes to the engine room itself are a Megan shock tower bar and Koyo radiator. The stunt car only number 33 label is still intact on the intake piping. With spots of red peeking through, the sheet metal under the hood appears to have been spray painted in a matte black and there are a few hits of overspray near the headlights from the orange pearl makeover. Keep in mind, this was a movie car which means there are going to be some imperfections, the trade-off being that this is a piece of movie and automotive history. According to Meekum's listing, there's an estimated $40,000 invested into the car's upkeep and maintenance, and that includes new wiring and unspecified engine and transmission work. The highest bidder will receive paperwork that officially documents the VIN number and the vehicles being used in those first two movies, as well as an outfit worn by Orange Julius and 2F2F, if you really want to get into character. An authentic piece of Hollywood memorabilia doesn't come cheap and nabbing this nostalgic Mazda is going to require an estimated $175,000 to $250,000 according to Meekum. The Indy auction takes place May 12th to 20th, where this RX-7 will join 3,000 vehicles up, for grabs during the Dana Meekum 36th Original Spring Classic.